welcome to UMetsat. My name is Hayley King and today I'm going to guide you through our UMetsat user portal. The user portal is a one-stop shop to find out all the information you might need about accessing and working with our data. It offers you the opportunity to learn about our data products, to access software and code, and to find out how to access data through a wide variety of different access means. In this video, we'll explore the user portal and learn about the different functionalities it has to offer you. Let's take a look at the landing page. When you arrive at the UMetsat user portal, you're greeted by the initial dashboard. And from here, you can find some of the latest information that we've released relating to our case studies. Clicking on one of these will open up an example of how our data has been useful in something recent that's happened in the news. You can also find the latest information about our satellite operation status on the right-hand side here, latest news and events, and the most recently updated user guides and documents. Via the UMetsat user portal, you can explore the data catalog. Clicking over here on the left will open that page for you. You can then search the catalog using terms that you may already know if you know the particular data set you're looking for. So for example, I could search for Sentinel-3 Ultra data, and this will pop up all the different search results and data catalog entries that relate to these terms. You can also filter on the right-hand side here. Clicking on one of these card entries here will give you an overview of the data product, tell you a bit of technical information about it, as well as some other relevant information relating to different collections and themes that this data set is uh, collected under. You can click up here to download the data via the data store if it's available through there. And you can learn more about where the data is accessible through other means under the access tab here. You can also get some more information through the resources and news and events tabs, which will tell you more about how to use this data and different news articles that may be relevant to new product releases under this type of data, for example. From the user portal, you can learn about using our data. And the central place to find out more about this is under the Using Data tab on the left. Here you can access different routes to learn about our data. You can either go through a thematic route, through a satellite route, or you can look generally across the resources we have available for you to learn more about using our data. If you click under the Themes tab, you can see five different themes that we offer um, about our data. And clicking under any one of these will provide you more information about that thematic area and our role at UMetsat in it. Um, as well as data products that are available related to this thematic area, resources that are available to help you learn more about this area and the data products that we provide towards it, as well as news and events that are related to these services that we provide or training courses, for example, that we might be running that might help you if you're interested in this particular theme of data. If you already know that you're looking to use data from a particular satellite mission, you can click on the Satellites tab and from here, you can find out more about the different data services and products available from the different satellites that we operate at UMetsat. Clicking on any one of the satellites will give you more information in a similar way to you saw under the thematic section about the data and resources, news and events that are available related to these different missions. You can filter the information available by the different services. For example, these are the ones available from Sentinel-3. And clicking under any one of these will give you a similar set of tabs, but also then filter down the data, resources, and news and events available specific to that particular service. If you want to explore the resources available across our satellites and themes, you can click on the Resources tab. And this will show you all the different case studies, documents, service status, software and code, and user guide related information that we provide across all our different satellite missions and thematic products. If you want to learn more about how to access our data, you can do this via the Data Access tab on the left here. And here you can then see all the different data services that UMetsa offers to serve our data. Clicking on any one of these will open what is probably now quite a familiar set of tabs, allowing you to look at the data that's served through these different mechanisms and the resources and news and events that are available for you to find more information about these different products and services. If you're interested in the latest news about our data products or perhaps would like to attend an event that we're running, you can find out about these through the news and events tab on the left here. And again, you can search these in a similar way to the other searches that you've seen so far in this video. The UMetsat user portal offers a powerful search functionality. You can access this through the bar at the top right hand side of the web page. And you can type in the box a particular search term if you already know what you're looking for. Or you can use the magnifying glass, open up the full search um, option and use the different filters on the right hand side. Just to show you how this works, I can ask for a particular piece of technical information that I know exists. You can see I can then find this information here.
The search interface is a good place to go if you want to explore different types of resource that we offer. In particular, for example, you could look at software and code by clicking on this filter here. It will show you all the different pieces of software and code that we provide related to the different data sets and services that we offer through UMETSA. Now that you know what the user portal can do, you can check it out at user.umetsat.int. And if you have any questions for us, contact our help desk by email at ops at